guys welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new my name is Amy and today I'm gonna to be sharing how I'm cleaning organizing and decluttering a few spaces in our apartment so I'm gonna be doing under our kitchen sink under our bathroom sink inside our bathroom mirror and we'll see if I find any other space any other spaces to declutter and organize in today's video but if you guys are new I'd love it if you would subscribe and make sure you give this video a thumbs up and let's get started So along with just reorganizing and making everything look a little better under the counters, I was going through things and getting rid of stuff that we didn't need or that I didn't want to keep any longer. If you guys are new here, my husband is in the military, so we will be moving here again shortly in the next few months or so. So I'm slowly starting to downsize on our stuff again and just get rid of things that we aren't going to want to take with us. And all of these little bins that I'm using in today's video, I got at the Dollar Tree. That is my favorite place to find bins for organizing and storage because they are so cheap. They're only a dollar each and they work really well. sink is where I keep all of our cleaning products, extra dish soap, hand soap, things like that. 
so I'm just reorganizing that and trying to get it a little bit better so I can see what everything is and what I have and it just make it look a little bit nicer for whenever I have to get things out of there. things like stuff back there our just our like diffusers and stuff that we're not using right now so they're just kind of stuff back there behind that basket and then I just have in here is some bleach a like bleach mixture and then a couple of our like cleaning utensils and duster stuff like that um and then up here this is my toy and high chair cleaner I use this for JJ's table and a high chair I have an extra sponge window cleaner, my squirt and mop, and then my resolve, which I use a lot between the dogs and JJ. We use that all the time, so that's easy to get to. And then our dishwasher soap. And then this is just like extra soap and just like more harsh chemicals and stuff. We just have them just in case. And then trash bags. And then over here we have our Clorox disinfecting wipes. I use these a lot as well. And then I have these two empty spare bottles that I can just use for whatever. And then in this little one, I have some of the wall plugins and my essential oils for the diffuser that I'm not using right now. This is our carpet spot treater vacuum thing. And here is all my Mrs. Myers stuff, extra soap and dish liquid, all purpose spray, my baking soda cleaner that I use on the sink a lot, and then an extra squirt and mop that I have. And then I also have this Grove Collaborative glass cleaner concentrate as well and then back there we have like our rug like our rug cleaner stuff whenever we rent a like rug doctor or whatever to clean the carpets we just have some of those left over i have some leather wipes that we don't use right now and then that is some like spray paint stuff so that's just back there it looks better i can see everything i'm happy with that
appreciate this art easel for Christmas. It's from Ikea. I absolutely love it. It's got a chalkboard, a whiteboard, and this roll of paper on it. So it is perfect for him. He loves drawing on it. As you'll see, he'll come in in just a minute and start drawing on it again. But I'm just straightening up his crayons and chalk. And then I'm just going to put some diapers and wipes away. That's it for today's video guys thank you so much for watching i hope this gave you some motivation to clean and organize and declutter whatever you need to in your house don't forget to give it a thumbs up and i would love it if you subscribe if you are not already and i'll see you guys very soon bye